He's Suki. Cool. Yeah, because I was thinking, when you think of the cliff, you think out to the ocean. I'm thinking, nah, it doesn't seem right. That's a California thing, but that was a sinkhole. That was a heck of a sinkhole. 62 degrees downtown temperature right now. 65 for Newark. Uh, generally, at this point, you're waking up to the mid 60s. I'm going to get to the dew points because that shows you how much moisture content is actually in the atmosphere. So right now, air temperatures in the mid 60s. Yesterday, yesterday afternoon, if you went out and went for a walk, it, it, the air temperatures in the 70s, but it felt miserable. And the reason the dew point temperatures today a little bit better. We're starting out in the 50s. This is basically the temperature at which the air becomes saturated. We have a chart that plays it out nice for you. So today, basically, we're in the pleasant area. Not so bad. But when we get into later on this afternoon and into tomorrow, that's when we see these dew point temperatures go. Well. Weekend, so that's perfect. Southbound on the Major Deegan. Let's take a look at the roads. We have a disabled car. This is approaching Yankee Stadium. It's still blocking the right lane. There's only minor delays there. Earlier I said you might want to take Harlem River Drive. I'm changing my tune on that because let's go live to the FDR Drive northbound. There's an accident at 69th Street blocking two lanes northbound. That's two lanes also being blocked southbound near 102nd Street with the vehicle spin out. So everything is backing way up Harlem River Drive. It's slow speed starting as high up as Fifth Avenue. So be really patient if you're coming down that way or you might even want to take Fifth Avenue and come straight down down the city. East River crossings, those are looking clear. We're talking the Brooklyn, the Manhattan, the Williamsburg. It's pretty good for this time of the morning. Things are moving right along in terms of transit. Same story. Long Island Railroad, New Jersey Transit, Metro North, they're all running on or close to schedule. So you're good for your morning. Alternate side parking rules, they are in effect today citywide. Back to you guys. At least three games. I think they can at least get three games, tie it up, then a game seven. I don't know what will happen. Sure. In your pocket there, Corey. I'm a gambling kind of gal. <laughs> Sorry, just kidding. Temperatures in the 60s out there early this morning. It is warm. It is muggy. It's just not the best start to the day. Later on this afternoon, you will see a couple of breaks in those clouds. So it will improve, and it is not as humid today as it was yesterday. Yesterday, it was ridiculous if you went out for a walk in the afternoon. Today, it feels just a little bit better. Tomorrow, it's back to ridiculous again. Mid-60s right now throughout New Jersey. Uh, waking up there, you're at 66 Morristown, 65 for Newark. In the city, we're at 63. Generally, in the suburbs this morning, you're looking at the low to mid-60s. So not a bad start as far as the temperatures are concerned. A little bit of some heavier rain up in the uh, Hudson Valley at this point. Got some heavier rain. Dutchess, Sullivan, Ulster counties. But in and around the city, that's about an hour and a half, eh, hour 15, depending upon how you drive, north of the city, in and around the city. At this point, you're looking at uh, very, very light sprinkles out there early this morning. Throughout much of the day, that's all we can expect, as well as a couple of breaks in the clouds. So you will see a little bit of sunshine. Here you go, a little round of light showers, some heavier showers off to the west. That's moving over towards the Delaware River at this point. Showers and thunderstorms really on and off throughout the entire day. A couple of breaks, little bit of everything for you. Mixed sun and clouds, a couple of showers, a couple of breaks in the clouds. We've got to get this entire mess out of here before we finally clear out. And the good news is that happens on Friday, the end of the day Friday. We get a line of showers and thunderstorms coming through. And then behind this, beautiful weather for both Saturday and Sunday. And this is now the third weekend in a row where we've had the miserable weather during the week. And then we hit the weekend and bam, it's beautiful. By the way, the end of the day today, 5 o'clock today, one one hundredth of an inch of rain. Nothing. Not hardly any. Very, very light sprinkles out there today. Tomorrow, a couple of more showers, about a tenth of an inch of a rain. As the t by the time we hit Friday, that's the line of heavy showers and thunderstorms. That will reach the city. Eleven Jungle to the newest member of the team, Caitlin Monty. Good morning Good. to you. Good morning. Good Thank to you have you much. here. Good doing, to be here. You're doing a great job all morning. <laughs> Thank you. I've been seeing all kinds of tweets, people saying, oh, she's fantastic. So, great. there you go. I promise that I'd reveal some more fun facts about you. Oh, good. Uh, I've been doing his facts. homework, too. Yes, last oh, hour, she facts. graduated at 19 from college. Oh, you're amazing. Which is that amazing. Is cool. Do you oh. have, like, a, uh, like, a, are you, like, a... I think I you a high IQ Mensa. Mensa. I think I'm just good at finding loopholes. She's good. Oh, so <laughs> you're not part of the Mensa system, right? No, not that. All right. Well, I found out a little bit more about Caitlin, all right? Check this out. So in her spare time, Caitlin likes uh -oh. video games. Sure. You should have given us multiple choice Hugs. questions. 
Pugs? Pugs. Pugs. Oh, pugs. Likes, if yeah. I see your pug on the street, I may hug it. Aww. I just, I hug pugs. I can't not. Or so like I've got a mutt you that you're going to hug. <laughs> All right. I, any, I mean, any dog. Do you have pugs? I had one growing up. She okay. was the greatest oh. dog. You go. She my best friend in college it. lived with me. She Aww. was amazing. Do you have a pug now? No, my landlord won't let me have oh, one. Oh, that, come on, landlord. Evil. Come on. Evil landlord. No. So, video games, pugs. She likes long walks on the beach. Oh, that sounds like a That's what he wants to do. This is what her dating profile is. And, and by the way, she also <laughs> performs with the USO. Did you know that? That's right. Yeah, in I, fact, there we are. are all the awesome. photo. Yeah, that picture. was uh, during Fleet Week. I've been doing that since 2009. That was my first job coming into New York. Uh, and they're the, they're are you show a singer? All over. Yeah, that was what I did when I first got out here. When I was young and it was fun, I started So you're a mechanical sing. engineer or aeronautics <laughs> engineer? You're like a singer of a part of it. Yeah. Wow, you're Not like a sure jack of all trades, be, aren't you? And a master of absolutely no. Oh. Hopefully trapped. Well, welcome to the Pixel of the Morning <laughs> News. <laughs> I just want to say, Suki and I also work extra during most across the board. That's with the cloud deck out early this morning. Temperatures tend to stay very uniform, and that's what's happening out there early this morning. Not a bad start at all. Cloudy, little dreary. Visibility better than yesterday morning. Eight miles in the city, which makes it a little bit better at the major regional airports. Just a couple of miles uh, over at West Hampton, though, so not the best. Just so you know, if you're driving in, it's not as bad as yesterday, but it's still not great. A couple of light sprinkles. If you're driving, maybe a minute or two with your windshield wipers and then you turn them off because it's just on again, off again. Very light showers out there early this morning. We also have some more rain coming in from the west and you can see how it loses its intensity there it was bright yellow so a little bit stronger losing its intensity atmosphere a little bit more stable on top of us today and that's why i do not do not think we're going to see the strong to severe thunderstorms today best shot for that is on friday today it's just a little dreary yet again we've got mostly cloudy skies out there a couple of breaks later on this afternoon with that you'll see a little bit of sunshine but we have uh, afternoon high temperatures not as high as yesterday yesterday. Not only that, but the humidity is a little bit more tolerable today. So a little bit better today than yesterday. Tomorrow we deteriorate again. Nine o'clock this morning, we're at 67 degrees. We've got the light showers out there. Later on this afternoon, you could see an embedded thunderstorm. I do not think uh, that... That's Linda. Good morning, everyone. Outbound on the Gowanus. There's still that accident after 39th Street blocking the right lane, like we said. And this is near 45th Street as well. Heavy delays in that area. This goes all the way back to the Verrazano. Like I said before, 4th Avenue is a much better option to cut through all of this because it is slow, slow, slow. So at least it's kind of a pretty view of the misty city along the water there. Southbound Bruckner. Let's go over there for a disabled car approaching Sheridan Expressway. This is blocking the left lane. So you can see here things are really slowing down. Look at that, 7 miles per hour. Not where you want to be this morning. So if you can find another way. If you can leave a little early, that's what you want to do. Queens bound on the LIE. There's an accident after the Northern State Parkway. This is blocking the HOV lane. You know what that means? Everyone's in the regular lane, so it's going to be crowded. Things are moving, but just not great. In general, everything is really backed up coming in from Long Island. So give yourself, I would say, an extra half hour if you have it, because you don't want to have to be stuck in that when you have that time crunch. MTA, let's talk about subways. Due to switch problems at Lawrence Street, no R train service from Court Street to Atlantic Avenue. Suspended, nothing to do there, but you can take the two, the three, the four to five. Everybody's running regular out of Brooklyn right now. It'll just allow yourself additional travel time so you're not stuck anywhere. Alternate side parking rules are in effect today, citywide. Thank you, Caitlin. Hey. All right, Kate, Cable Talk is all about the newest member of our Pix Level Morning News team, and that's Caitlin Monty. She's our traffic reporter. How was today? How it, was, it was great. Got yeah. better by the minute. Yeah. You guys were all so supportive. Everyone here is so friendly, yeah. so it made it that much better. Well, it's good. It's good because it's going to just get downright done. Because it's done. not going to last. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's a lot of fun. <laughs> Pictures, uh, I guess, of you like, growing up. Or, uh, yeah, yeah, I think. Tell us what we have here. Gathered a whole bunch, so let's see what they show. Okay, so this is me. Um, this well, is this on is the Mets station. Right. So, oh my I'm a huge Mets fan. So, for anybody who is, if you guys are watching the Mets games tonight on Picks, I'll be there with you watching. Uh, really sad to see Darnell go down back to the minors. You'll have to get tickets? Uh, I will see what I can do. All right, okay. this is me in college as an animal trainer at Bush oh, Gardens. So, I performed amazing. in a show, and I had to perform with the animals as if they were like interacting and talking to me. And so, I had to learn to train them as a wallaby. Wally, he liked to climb on people. Um, we worked with 80 different animals. It was kind of wild. So, awesome. I had grown up with like 50 lives, and you're like not even. I've done a million different things. Yeah, wow, that's so, awesome. Yeah, what's this one here? This is Times Square New Year's Eve. This is with the USO. I had the chance to perform in front of a million revelers on TV. 
Team Super Squad, yeah. it was crazy. Lewis, though, is such a great organization. Wonderful stuff. This is oh, a three week. Oh, there you um, go. A little bit of 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 a little bit